Hello everyone, it's me, your favorite girl, Just TV. Welcome to my channel. If this is your first time joining me, you're welcome. Kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell. Should in case uh, I post a, another, a new video so you don't miss out. So in today's video, we'll be talking about house rent in Ghana. Hmm. A lot of people have been asking me, how much is house rent in Ghana? How much is house rent in Ghana? Um, can you just give us a clue on how much? A, a one bedroom flat is two bedroom three bedroom so in today's video I will, I will be talking about all that so firstly if you are trying to relocate to ghana but you want to you want to have an idea on how much house rent is in ghana i think firstly it depends on your budget do you get it one firstly it depends on your budget and the location that you are actually planning to relocate do you get it? the location and your budget like if you are dreaming of coming to the city like uh places like osu east legong and all that spin text those places are very very expensive like it's very very expensive to be sincere it's very very expensive houses around there cost like um just for a single room a single room uh i think you get a single room like self-contained you get it something around four thousand ghana cities four thousand ghana cities so like currently four thousand ghana cities in naira should be around um three hundred and eighty thousand naira yes three hundred and eighty thousand naira per month i'm not talking about yearly like if, if you're coming to to places like osu east legon spin test and all that just and and maybe you want to get you're looking for you're searching for an apartment of a um a self-contained one room safe container just keep between three hundred and eighty thousand naira to four hundred and eighty thousand, even to five hundred thousand naira a month, a month. Then, if you are looking for something like uh, a one bedroom flat, two bedroom, okay, one bedroom flat for like within within these areas that I've mentioned, we can keep like we can keep like five hundred and fifty thousand naira to seven hundred thousand naira. Do you get it? Then. If, if you don't want to stay in places like this but you want a places uh, places that are also cool do you get it but it's not that expensive then you can look at dan suman Weja, um there are other places there are other nice places do you get it so a bedroom one bedroom apartment one bedroom flat in dan suman is around is around two thousand five hundred Ghana cities that is around 220,000 naira per month between 220,000 naira to 350,000 naira per month if you're looking for places like Dansoman, Weja, um, mm, Sakama do you get it? Uh -huh. then two bedroom apartments two bedroom apartments in these places that I've mentioned you will get it something around uh from three 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 thousand five hundred ghana cities and above so which is around uh three hundred and twenty thousand naira per month do you get it so if you don't want a place that is more affordable very very much affordable you can go to bawe inside bawe or kaswa but trust me i do not advise anyone to go to kaswa in search of accommodation do you get it yeah i don't really like kaswa it's very very far and sometimes that place is not a bit um safe yeah though a lot of people are living there and they have no issues with kaswa so if you want a place that is much affordable like when you go to kaswa you see most nigerians they have houses over there do you get it they have, they have houses over there so over there land is very very uh cheap and accommodation is very very cheap i mean very very cheap do you get it but there is not inside accra kaswa is not inside accra do you get it it's very very far then uh, cape coast cape coast is very very far but houses over there are very very affordable do you get it they can also check around um ashley 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 is also a very nice place yeah actually it's a very nice place and uh, the houses there are also affordable do you get it then in case you don't know how to get houses maybe uh you're not in ghana you're not in accra and you don't know how you can get a, uh, accommodation you can you can go through uh facebook marketplace 
do you get it you can search through facebook marketplace and i also have legit uh, uh agents as an agent that can get you one should in case you don't trust all these online agents i also have a legit agent that can also get you accommodation do you get it so um for now for now for now the best place like if you are coming to ghana for the first time i think the best place you can especially when you have children especially if you're coming with children and uh, that's why it's cool it's very nice it's very beautiful very cool estate it's not noisy you will love it you will enjoy it very very well do you get it so for now um these are the little uh this thing i can give you in case you're searching for uh accommodation before relocating to ghana then i have a little tips for you a very little tip should in case you get an accommodation please don't be in a hurry to sign uh the agreement you see the agreement that the landlord will give you eh? don't be in a hurry to sign it because hmm, yeah i don't know i don't really know how to put it but don't be in a hurry to sign the agreement okay just take your time go through it carefully read it thoroughly okay before signing because when you sign it, it means you've agreed to everything that is being written in there okay so you just take your time go through it and see if there's any one that's uh, that is confusing probably you have any question you can ask the landlord and all that